This is 947 Breakfast Express. Please welcome to the studio Roastmaster General, Mr. Jeffrey Ross. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, Jeff. Good morning to you guys. Thanks for having me on your show. It's an absolute pleasure, Jeff. What a legend you are, sir. Wow. I'm trying to butter you up before this roast happens. You're really throwing that word around right now. <laughs> <laughs> You're buttering me up? Why? I don't know. We, we, we haven't been sleeping, Jeff. Why not? Because we knew about this roast. A roast that we actually wanted. <laughs> Do your fans know what a roast is yet? They what? know exactly what a the roast is. The movement has spread to South Africa? It has. It has. All your roasts have been on uh, Comedy Central here. When I first started doing the roast years ago in America, it was a lost art, like jousting or something. <laughs> and slowly it's picked up where it's mainstream. Well, I suppose it's also the guys that uh, you roast that are relevant at the time, I guess. Eh? Did you see the Bieber roast? Oh, we did. That yeah. one could have been a three-part miniseries. <laughs> <laughs> now, the backlash from Believers, that must have been massive because that's like a militia on their own. And there's like 50 million of them. I know. And he's banged all of them. <laughs> 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 but that's how it is you know it was like hitting the reset button on his career it was huge for him yeah it was we want to roast kanye west next do you think that'd be good oh. i think that'll be fantastic i don't know if you'd do it though oh my god it'd be the best roast ever yeah it would. just his rebuttal at the end would be classic <laughs> <laughs> just you know you need an extra two seats for his wife's ass <laughs> <laughs> we're doing a roast friday night are you gonna be there i am gonna be there what's it's... gonna happen I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll be led by the roast master, you. It's going to be so much fun. Yeah, it is uh, Friday night at uh, Silver Star Casino, 7 o'clock in the, uh, what is that? that? The Globe. The Globe. It's, it's a beautiful little big theater. I hope you come there and you wear that shirt. I'll have plenty of material. <laughs> <laughs> great. Where do you shop? Forever 31? <laughs> Great. Not a lot of guys have the guts to wear their shirt from fourth grade when they go to work, but you did it there, Darren. What a crew you got here. <laughs> this is really fun. You guys really have great chemistry there, Felicity. You, the two of you. Yeah. Bring back apartheid and break this show up. <laughs> Am I cutting too deep? I don't know what's supposed to... I don't know where to draw the line. No, no, no. You're doing just fine. You're doing just fine. It's so, a lot of fun. So I'm guessing the roast has started. <laughs> or are you just warming up? Uh, first of all, I'm not roasting you because you're not famous. Okay? Uh <laughs> This is a drive-by, okay? Take what you can get. Darren, I love guys who cut their own hair. You're so yeah. cool. <laughs> this is great. Where's your wife? Is she in high school right now? We're oh! doing her homework. Oh! What's going on? <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. she's very beautiful. Have I you seen pictures? Have you been doing research? Seeing pictures? I, don't, I guess if you call that seeing, I was stared at him for hours <laughs> no i don't want to stay there wrong i don't want to hurt your feelings because i know you're sensitive yeah where are you from exactly where do you live i'm from the south of Joburg. all right i'll talk slower um <laughs> <laughs> fun. and who's this guy over here Brad. i know he's not your bodyguard or your trainer <laughs> jeez <laughs> and who's that back there? The pot dealer? <laughs> oh, wow! That is Gavin Daisel. He's our controller. Yet. Really? He's got bigger boobs than Felicity. <laughs> That's great. What a crew. Congratulations. <laughs> Call it the Reach for a Dream Team. The Reach for a Dream Team? Uh, we have a word for that in America. It's called retarded, but we don't use it much. I don't know what I could say here on the radio, you know. Nah, you, you, you're fine. You're fine. You're well within your limits. I'm warming up for our big show, you know. We're yeah. gonna, if people don't bring me all the way over here and then want it subtle. Yeah, yeah. Roasting is about going right to the line. You want to push but not break. So you're going to be roasting the audience. Uh, never been done before. Is that right? I'm going to attempt to speed roast South Africans live on stage. So if you're listening to this and you've always wanted to be roasted or see a roast, this is your chance. At a certain point in the show, Friday Night at the Globe, I will ask for volunteers to come on stage. So if you're listening to this and you're pregnant or handicapped, you have a social obligation to come to the Globe <laughs> and let me... Make fun of you. <laughs> For the good of mankind, because if you can laugh at yourself, 
That's a great, great quality in a person. That's wonderful. It is. It's I, a I, worldwide movement. Yeah. Roasting in Africa. This is huge. Yeah, yeah. And uh, where, where's the line between roasting and trolling? <laughs> trolling? Yeah. No. Don't try to roast me back, okay? It's no, not no. going to work. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. First of all, am I being pranked? When I talked to you on the radio, uh, over the phone, I thought you were a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Am I being pranked right now? I was like, this small boy or woman is, has a radio show. And then I get over here and there's a, a grown man <laughs> wearing, a, wearing a child's shirt. <laughs> he wears a nice watch to make himself look grown. This is some of the greatest things that have ever been said to me. Do you know that? Really? Yeah. All yeah. right. Well, anything to take the uh, pressure off uh, Felicity over here. Oh, thank yeah. you. You look lovely. Thank you very much. Yeah. Love your coconuts. <laughs> so do I. <laughs> They're actually funnier than that TV show you were on. Oh! <laughs> oh coconuts! <laughs> I think you're playing with kids over here? Come on. <laughs> you're adorable. Oh, wow. Well, you guys are fun. What a crew here. How many people listen to this? Seven? <laughs> is this show popular right now? Yeah, it is. We got we got 1.6 million people listening, Jeff. Really? And, and of those, how many of them have $4 to buy a ticket to anything? <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, we LSM uh, 8 to 10. Okay, good. Yeah. Are we going to pack the house Friday night or what? Jeff, we are going to pack the house. You're going to see, you're going to see you, you've never played to a South African audience, but you're no. going to... You're going to see a lot of love. South African audiences are wonderful to play to. I can't wait. Any yeah. advice? Mm, mm, me give you advice? Are you yeah. kidding me? Are you kidding me, Jeff? With, you know, it's your crowd. It's your town. That's all I'm saying. No, what you do is perfect. Mm. They're coming to see you. Felicity's taking my picture. For later. Do you think I like looking like Bruce Willis if he drowned? <laughs> <laughs> You think I like looking like Lex Luthor's accountant? <laughs> this is fun. And who's this Somali boat pirate in the corner? <laughs> That's Jacob Mashoko. <laughs> really? <laughs> the Somali boat pirate. Yeah. Up, <laughs> How you doing, man? I'm good. Thanks for asking. What do you do here? I read the news. All right. Well, I'm the captain now. <laughs> You read the news? Yes, I do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. We got Bill Cosby's rape baby in the corner. Oh! <laughs> We're cutting deep here tonight, this morning, <laughs> on the radio. You guys are good sports. This is a fun town. That's what I love about it. People here in Joburg. So far, can take a joke. And that's what I need, is people who love to laugh. If you come to our show on Friday night, here's the thing. There's so much talk about sex on stage, you're guaranteed to get some action. So bring a date. Doesn't matter if you're a guy or girl, whatever you're into, come to the show. Guaranteed that night, you're going to want to go right upstairs and get a hotel room and make it happen. Oh, wow. Jeff Ross, ladies and gentlemen. How's that? Jeff Ross. That was fantastic. How's that for a guarantee? 100% Friday night, as you said, at Silver Star. <laughs> Jeff, this is this. <laughs> I'm still on the Somali boat pirate. <laughs> thing. Uh, he looks great. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, you are fantastic, sir. Thank you very much for coming in. Thanks for having me on. Congrats on your awesome show, and I'll see you Friday. Absolutely. Awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, Thanks, Jeff everybody. Ross! <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Joe Berg's number one hit music station.